Hi, this is Frank Efner here with Technique Peak. Today we're going to go through a, a cervical active range of motion exam. So we're going to take Rob through all of the motions. So Rob, we're going to have you look down, chin towards your chest. I'm just going to apply a little overpressure. Good. And I'm going to have you look all the way up towards the ceiling. Apply, apply overpressure. Straight ahead. And look towards your right. And I'm going to have you look towards your left. And look straight ahead again. And I'm going to have you side bend to your left. And I'm going to have you side bend to your right. Okay. Next, we're going to take Rob into all four quadrants. So, Rob, I'm going to have you look back and to the right. And look straight ahead. And we're going to have you look back and to the left. So, now we're working on closing on each side in the cervical segments. Now I'm going to have you look down and to the right. So now we're looking at opening of the left cervical segments. And now look down and to the left. Now we're looking at opening of the right cervical segments. And look straight ahead. So based on where the patient kind of reports pain and you see limited motion, based with the cervical active range of motion and doing the quadrant testing, that can determine what you will we'll do as far as intervention. This is Frank with Technique Peak.